The remote control is one of many options Hoist offers its customers and is available on most models. In this video, we will overview the functionality of the remote control option. To start the lift truck, first make sure the key is turned to the on position and the remote control is on. The remote control is turned on by pressing upward on the knob titled transmitter. You will know the remote control is activated as it will be indicated by a green flashing light on the top left hand side of the controller. To start the engine, make sure the parking brake is applied. This is done by pressing on the button titled Park Brake. Then, push upward on the knob titled Engine Start and hold momentarily until the engine starts. Once the engine has started, to travel, release the parking brake pressing down on the button titled Park Brake and turn the engine speed dial from idle to the appropriate speed for your job. Although no one will be on board when utilizing the remote, the horn button located to the left of the engine knob can be used to alert anyone within the vicinity before moving the lift. Additionally, the red emergency stop button is located on the bottom right of the remote and serves as an additional safety feature. To extend the chassis on the FR using the remote control, press down on the knob titled frame. To retract the chassis, press upward on the knob titled frame. To drive the lift truck in reverse, press down on the knob titled drive. To drive the lift truck forward, press up on the knob titled drive. To steer left or right, use the knob titled steer. To steer to the left, push the knob titled steer to the left. To steer right, push the knob titled steer to the right. To raise or lower the mast, use the knob titled mast. To raise the mast, press downward on the knob titled mast. To lower the mast, press upward on the knob titled mast. To side shift left or right, press the knob titled SS to the right or the left. To side shift right, press the knob titled SS to the right. To side shift left, press the knob titled SS to the left. To tilt the mast forward or back, use the knob titled tilt. Press upward on the knob titled tilt to tilt the mast forward. Press downward on the knob titled tilt to tilt the mast backward. To utilize the fork position or option, use the knob titled FP. To increase the distance between the forks, press the knob titled FP to the right. To decrease the distance between the forks, press the knob titled FP to the left. The charging station for the battery to the remote can be found in the operator compartment. Plug the cable into the appropriate outlet and the battery will safely charge. 